Mrs. O'Brien's boy, Eddie. Heart trouble? It looks like heart trouble to me. Sure, what kind of an Irish lad is that can sit here while the fiddlers are fiddling, the pipes are piping, and the cottage are smiling like it was the wedding night? Why, you should be leaping in the air, knocking your heels together, doing a handsome clock. Come, Come on, on. Come on. Listen, sir. Michael, me boy. Fine. Fine. To get who is with the greatest dancers in all Ireland. Listen to step me, Uncle Toffee, the light of the big wind. Now you can see why the O'Briens were the first kings of Ireland. Yeah. Right. A little hoof of that O'Brien. Not a bad shortstop either. Uh, that infield wouldn't be much good without him. Where did you get that hat? Where did you get that hat? Where did you get that hat? Where did you get that hat, folks ask me every day. Isn't it a nifty one, you often hear them say. Put it on, it's funny, can't you see the people smile? It keeps me busy telling them the history of this tile. It's the hat me dear old father wore upon St. Patrick's Day. Now talk about respect with his head erect as he marched down old Broadway. Sure not a man in line looked half as fine me dear old mother he used to say as your father did in his old time live upon St. Patrick's Day it's the hat me dear old father wore upon St. Patrick's Day talk about respect with his head erect as he marched down Not a man in line looked half as fine. Me dear old mother he used to say, as your father did in his old time lived upon St. Patrick's Day. Oh. 